if I say, um, oh man, hot dog. If I say hot dog, I'm I don't I'm losing the plot. Okay. Okay. If you say hot dog, I'll kick open the trunk and yeah, yeah, take you away from yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. I'll cut. I'll, okay, I'll, perfect, yeah, I'll stop after that. I'll get you out of there. Quickly, so he can't put you under his spell. Thank you, Lottie. Thank you. You're welcome. I got your back. Where is he? Can't believe he's making you wait so long. Sell a bit or not. Um, I'm breaking up with Murphy, I think. I'm with Lottie at the pier. What? She's hiding in my, the trunk. Lottie at the pier? The of a car. Um, what? Uh, and he's coming now. He's hiding in the trunk of a car? He's not what? hashtag providing. Oh my god, anymore. if you need me, just let and me know. I need to be... Be a free bird. I'm shocked you're dumping him. Okay. Oh my okay. god. Oh my um, god. Well, well, not... not I go eavesdrop so bad? Sure. If he agrees to open his wallet a little more. Um, we'll see. We will we'll stay together. I'll keep you updated. Oh shit, he's calling! Ah! Hey, Murphy! Strong. Hi, I had a headache, a uh, little delay, uh, but I'm, I'm getting my car and I'm on my way right now. Okay? okay, I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. See you soon. Bye. Lottie, I can't dump him! What'd he say? what did he say? He's too sweet. He just, he's so sweet, you know? I can't do it. What? I can't. I have Sally? to marry him. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on. Slow down now. Hold okay, on. Sorry, just sorry, hold up a second, girl. Yeah. What, what, just what? slow down. Slow what? down. Take a deep breath. <sighs> okay. Yeah, okay. no, 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 no. You got this, okay? Okay, I got you it. Will... You know your were, right? And then no boy with pretty uh, eyeballs and a soft voice gonna gonna take away your work, no, right? No, no, absolutely. Okay? I yeah. am April fucking foes. I will get my Stop bag. Me. If he doesn't provide, I will dump him. I need him to okay. Is there like a lot like am I is like I'm trying to think to myself, like if does he if he, if he agrees to like make it a deposit of like ten grand a week, am I happy oh, twenty trying, grand a want. week? Like what do I want? I just what? feel like well, he, he doesn't, he doesn't, I just wish he'd, he'd, he'd think about me more. Like, like wake up and be like, what is April, what would make April happy? You know, I just want to think that every day. And then maybe just that train of thought every day would make him change his yeah, actions. Well, what, what would make you feel, um, thought of? Well, if I woke up and my bank was going up a little bit every day. Okay. How much do you need? To feel that message. I, I mean, not much, honestly. If I just woke up and every day there was 5k more, even on the days I'm out of town when I go to Spokeshmella. Yeah, that's Shmella, reasonable. Yeah, if I, if I came reasonable. back and I had 20 grand more than when I left, I, yeah. I, I'm not hard to please. I, I feel like I'm quite simple. You're a simple girl with simple needs. I'm a simple girl with simple needs. Thank you, Lottie. Yeah. <sighs> oh god, I can't dump him. Well, you know, what you could do, you know, taught me this about discussion trees okay. and safe scumming. Basically, if this talk doesn't go well, we're right near the ocean. You could just push him into the water and try again until you get the outcome you wanted. Body? Yeah. You sound like, you sound like a psychopath. You want me to push oh. him into the oh. ocean until no. he... Oh, no. I'm, I'm not, I'm not pushing... Met <laughs> metaphorically, I'm 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 not a psychopath. Well, I'm I like He's like just a metaphorical push in the right to you know push to the ocean of possibilities. Okay. Of what this relationship could be, but push him and his um. Okay. If it doesn't go well, relationship. Okay, so I'll say hamburger. Okay, hot dog is I need help with um with dialogue, and and okay. hamburger is I'm gonna ocean dump his ass and 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 try again later. Like real ocean dump or yeah. metaphorical? Oh, like I'm chucking his ass into the ocean. Okay, but either way. But you help me. I should kick open the trunk and get your. Yes. Have your back. Uh okay. yeah. Okay. Well, well, if I say hamburger, if I say hamburger, I'm gonna need to jump out of the trunk and hit him, and then if, I'll, I'll if, if you say hot dog, I need to step in. 
Step for in. you yes okay start and do april me. impression okay, oh, or okay. start texting oh, oh actually the texting or you can do whenever oh shit he's coming okay okay here, here he is keep your cool okay you got this hello hey murphy it's your girl april how are you doing um i'm good i'm good um I, ah, how are you doing? Um, you know, I've been really busy. I'm, uh, running for office again. Someone tried to assassinate me in court yesterday. Uh, like, like, tried to shoot you? Uh, no, did stab me, uh, and tried to stab another judge during a court case. Oh my god! Yo, you better, you better Fucking what get the back, bro. Fuck? Murphy. <clears throat> uh, uh, you okay? You killed him. I mean, he just like was crazy. He came right at you. He did. Wow, Murphy. Thank you. Um, yeah, and stay down. Fuck you. Oh my god. Don't 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 get that all over your shoes. Oh shit, sorry. Um well anyway, I'm sorry to hear about the they that they shot you. Are you okay? Oh no, oh no, oh no. I, are you okay? The guy just attacked you. I I feel fine. I mean he just kinda like hit my face, but um I can't really feel the left side of my face and um there's a ringing in my ears, but other than that, it's okay. Um so um, I I wanted to talk to you a little bit. Okay. Um well, I feel like we should get to know each other a little bit more, and, well, I figured we'd share, like, one thing that I've done with a couple of my exes, not to bring up my exes, because that's crazy, um, but I, um, I like to share my love languages and, and how I give love and receive love, and maybe you could also share that, and then that way we could, like, communicate better, because sometimes I'm like, if I'm thinking, like, how do I want to let Murphy know that I love him? I don't know how to do that exactly. And if you could tell me that, you know, then maybe I could better be equipped for this. And then you could also hear me out. Uh, wow. You know, that, that wasn't quite what I was expecting. What were you um, expecting? But yeah, I think that's good. No, I, I, I think that's great. Um, just, you know, we need to talk is usually like a, a signaler of, uh, you know, a difficult conversation. This sounds more like a, a good a good conversation to have. Oh, you thought yeah, I was dumping I, you? No, no. It's just uh, it's just you know, we we, oh. we got to have a little talk. It's just you know, when it, when is that ever good? You know, but but this is this is actually kind of good. Yeah, no, this is good. You and I, you and I are very similar. I think <laughs> that we communicate through action more yeah. than, than than words. Exactly. Like words is all just yeah. it's all just spin. It's all just yeah. It gets lost in the ether. We just t talk and talk and talk. Like so we don't so rely true. on verbal agreements or no. anything like that. No, we, we're we, all about action. We show our commitments and our our uh, energies towards people through through our behavior. Right. So communication is tough. It's tough. That, like, Absolutely. Um, so why don't you start? Like, how would you like to, well, what is, what is, what is you know, your, your, your receiving love language versus your giving love language? Um, well, to be honest, like, so, some of these things you kind of do already. Oh, like? So, again, this is something we both have in common. We both kind of, uh, respect our time, right? Because it's limited True. and it's valuable. And, uh, you know, in, in turn, we tend to respect other people's time more than others. When you spend time with me, you're not on the fucking phone all the time. I'll put it that way. And never during our time together, I have noticed, uh, in particular, I'll point out your friendship with Taco. Other areas of your life, which has suffered to accommodate me, which is very flattering to me. Which is also why I put taco insurance on your turbo, so you two would have an excuse to spend time with each other. You know, uh, I, I feel like you value my time, and when you agree that you're going to spend time with me, you don't get 
caught up in other shit. And when you're going to get caught up in other shit, you don't like say that you have time for me and then say, oh, me, uh, go here. And if I don't call you, it means I'm coming like everybody else in the city. And then, you know, you're leaving somebody waiting for an hour. You don't do that shit. If you're busy, you're busy. Yeah. You don't, you don't, you don't mince words about that. Oh. So oh. that, that is something you already do, which I, I, I value a great deal. And it shows that you care about my time. And if you don't have time for me, you're not going to like try to fucking squeeze me in and end up wasting a bunch of my time. Of and course time. not. Okay. So I kind of, it's quality time, maybe? <laughs> You're very generous of your time with me, and uh, he loves me. You're never, you're never distracted <laughs> when you when you when you commit to spend time with me. Yeah. Does that make sense? No, no, it totally does. And I appreciate that. He's too healthy. He is too healthy. And right. that to me is one of the biggest things. God damn it! He's most too people, healthy. They want something from no, me, no, and they want to no, waste no, a whole no, lot of my no, time. No, 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 no. I would never, Murphy. I would never. This I'm, is a I'm sure you experienced that too. Of course. I do. You always value my time. Except for right well, no. now on the pier making me wait, but that's fine. Making you wait? Yeah. You said your head you had a headache, but I stood here. My leg was cramping. But other than oh. that, you've been very sweet about it. Um, okay, so that's how you okay, what about how you receive wait, give love. What's your favorite, like, way to give love and show love and show that you love me? Um, I mean, I, I don't know if I could pick a favorite. I mean, I like, uh, I like coming up with nice ways to make you laugh or make you smile. God damn it. And surprising you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. There's a, there's a wrong answer. Okay, Murphy. <laughs> no, I mean, I think that that's really sweet, Murphy, but like, how about I tell you mine? Okay. I'd love to hear yours. Yeah. So, I, I, I'm going to be fully honest, you know, um, because I feel like our relationship deserves honesty and you're somebody that I've been pretty communicative with when I'm not happy or if I'm really happy, you know, I feel like I've always told you. So I feel like yeah. um, I, you know, out of quality time, physical touch, um, um, words of affirmation, there's, uh, there's um, acts of service. And then the last one is uh, gift giving. I, um, I do like to receive a lot of, um, I like to receive gifts as a um as probably my number one and i'm not it, i'm not i'm not really feeling the love recently <laughs> okay just to, just to throw in like doing nice things for you was like inclusive of what you're saying like, oh my god no you've done like Acts of service, you also crush. Like I, I want to say, like when you set up the party, when you got me the ninety nine turbo, when you um, like did all that, you're you're crushing it. Acts of service is definitely number two for me. It's very high up there, and you are like the like you're so you're so good at that. But I feel like I am lacking in the receiving gifts department, um, and I think you were doing really well initially, especially when we'd be in the, like with the parking spot, that was like every day I woke up and I was happy, you know, every single day. And then after that, um, I noticed my mood started to go down. Like, and I didn't know why. And I think I was, I realized that there was no more like daily loot box in the, um, in the glove box anymore. And, yeah, I and then know. I had to like come down to the apartment and it wasn't yeah. the same, was it? Because it was like, it's, it sucked. you know, it's like it you sucked. had to wait for me to come bring you the stuff. And then like uh, you were happy to not go to the hospital. But it was like yeah. it, instead of you just having the stuff and then like you see me and you're like, oh, thank you. It was like, oh, man, you know, it's a whole the whole chore for the both of us at that point. You, it really sucks just, what happened with the house. You know, I just want to say that. I don't, I'm not saying that you're getting comfortable in, in our relationship, but I feel like there was a lot of effort at the beginning and 
And there's still effort, of course. Like the birthday party was like the highest effort. And I have been at Smoke Schmella this whole past weekend. So there wasn't really much opportunity for you to show, you know, much love to me. But I won't lie. I have to be fully honest. When I woke up and my bank account was at the same place as it was before I left. Um, I guess, um, it, it hurt, you know, it was, um, disappointing. It was less than what I was hoping for. Well, you were away. That is, that is something I'll take into consideration, but I have also been extremely extremely <laughs> laser focused I know. on scaring up the votes that i need to get a 100 percent pay raise and a seat on the city council which is my number one priority going into the future which right. is a very bright future that i think includes you a great deal right no one and i and that, that, that vote is coming up very soon. I, I do want to say, weekend. like, I really am. I, I want you to get that pay raise and I want you to go for that. But does that mean that that takes a priority over me? Doesn't you're part of that priority. How can I be part of that priority? I don't understand. Okay. A hundred percent pay raise enables me to do what? A hundred percent more nice things. The two things are not independent concepts. Okay, you're right. Um, I sorry. I'm, sorry. Not, I'm not. I'm not saying. I'm not saying. In the meantime, go get fucked. That's not what I'm saying at all. I'm saying I just like I. I have been busy, like and getting like almost assassinated, and a lot of shit has been going on. There's a lot I'm, of I'm like in, I'm, me, I'm deep me, in me, politics me, me happening from yeah. you um, right now. I'm. I'm. I'm being honest with you. That's. That's what I've been up to the past week. Uh, I've been deeply campaigning and in politics mode. And uh, like you said, you haven't you haven't been around too much, so. Yeah, you know, but don't you think you could have you. like? I missed you. Okay, but what if you woke up and thought to yourself, like, how could I make April happy today? Like, I feel like you should start your day with that thought. I start my day with that thought every single day. Okay, but what actions are you taking to follow up with that? What actions am I? <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's. Uh, so toxic. Let's uh, let's not forget about all the actions I've already taken. All right. Yeah, but those are in the past, Murphy. I mean, not that I consider them nothing, but I want this to be an ongoing thing where we don't get comfortable. Like I said, I need effort on the daily. <laughs> yeah. Am you know, I crazy? You know who, who, like, do I sound high maintenance or something? <laughs> no, not at all. Okay. <laughs> I just don't think you have any need to shake me down. What do you mean, shake you down? I'm not shaking you down. <laughs> you don't have to ask. You know, I'll just give it to you. Okay, and that, that's, this, this is progress. This is progress. That's perfect. But like, I feel like I have to ask because why are we here right now? Like, you know? You know what it feels like to me sometimes? Yeah, what? It feels like I do something of my own accord without you having to ask and you get all flustered. And things get real, and the next time I see you, it's like this. It's like a fucking boardroom negotiation. Like, back to zero. I don't like that. I'm sorry you don't like that, but I feel like I was pretty open from the start about how things are going to go and my priorities and things that I want from this relationship, no? Oh shit. He's he's giving me attitude, yeah, guys. He's giving me attitude. This is just me communicating then, my needs, Murphy. 
uh, do you not want me yeah, to communicate you're doing how it, I you're feel? Doing it, you're doing it stone cold. I am. He's growing a backbone, guys. What do we do? He's growing a backbone. Well, you know what I need is to know what the fuck is up with this Brecker's situation. That's what I need to know. I'm sorry. What do you mean? What is up with this Brecker situation? I don't know. Why do I got Brecker's calling me all the time about you? What? Why? Why do I got to fight a fucking clown in the street? Because of you. Well, I'm trying to make sure the party goes well. Who's the clown? Are you talking about Breckers? Bozo and Breckers and and and, and whoever the That's fuck else is trying fault. to stir That's shit up. That's not my fault. That's not my fault. Bozo is in love with me. Breckers is in love with me. Uh, uh, you know uh, what am I supposed to do? I was trying to tell Bozo I'm not into him, and he's persisting. You know, I I don't know. I, I'm not just gonna walk away. Yeah, well, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do when all these guys are coming after you in fucking public places and uh, fucking uh, fucking with my reputation and all that? You know, you want me to like end up shooting somebody and losing my job and all that shit? No. Fuck fight over you. I mean, maybe and a little bit. Why are you bit. encouraging? Why are you encouraging this shit? When you do that shit publicly, it's like you're trying to hurt me, and I, I don't like that shit. I know, I know, you're trying to fucking hustle money and shit all the time. You can have as many kitties as you want to, but you fucking humiliate me in public. Uh, fucking, uh, just like messing around with a bunch of dudes in front of me. It's, uh, it seems directed at me. I'm not responsible for the, uh, me. I'm not responsible and, like, for the actions of them. And like you're trying to get me to do stupid shit that's short-sighted and gonna uh, fuck me over. Stop yelling at me! I am not raising my voice. You're screaming! You will know! <laughs> oh, no, I am screaming. <laughs> We're just being honest. I respect your game and I respect your needs. No. And I have always been here to be supportive of that. And it is not any burden to me to make sure you have everything you need. Give me one. But when you go from fucking hot to cold on me like this, between the times we see each other, it fucks me up. Because I will fucking riz you up to the point where you're ready to fucking marry me or some shit. And then I see you the next time and it's like we just met. It's like 51st dates, April. It's not healthy. It doesn't not sound healthy. like you're happy with me, Murphy. Be honest. I don't think you're happy. I didn't know you I've felt never, this way. I've never been happier in my life. <laughs> We're not normal people, April. We are fucked up, toxic elites. I have never, strange needs. ever been okay. happier. <laughs> okay, Cassie. Now that means that we're messy. <laughs> and probably that's not going to change. But it means we're in a pretty decent position to be able to forgive each other a bunch of times before this falls apart. So, look, I want to be honest and I want to work through, through this shit. Well, I've seen you be fucking real with me, and I've seen you put on this fucking show for me, too. And I'm just, I'm, I, it annoys I'm me. I'm always, I'm always real with you. I don't understand. What do you mean, put on a fucking show for you, Murphy? I'm telling you what I want. I'm communicating. Okay. Okay. So... I don't know. Just you, you're telling me you've never been happier, but then all I'm hearing is that you complaining about being with me. I'm not complaining about being with you. I'm just being honest about fucking shit that I've noticed that I've been keeping a lid on. I've been planning your fucking birthday party, paying off your car. Excuse me, why are you talking you. like these are burdens? Doing all this fucking They're shit not. for you, planning your birthday party, paying off your car. You. You should be well, happy been busy to do doing this for this. me. Um, I am happy to do it for you, but it means we haven't had time to actually fucking spend with each other because I've been busy doing that and you've been busy doing whatever else you've been doing. And I am happy. Rolls eyes. And I'm happy that we're talking and being fucking honest. 
What? You don't you don't you don't think I'm telling the truth, do you? No, I don't. I tell you that I want communication from you. You say you're going to be honest. And then I, I tell you this stuff that I want more from the relationship. And then you, you're, you're acting like I've just been burning you the whole time. I didn't even ask for the birthday party. I loved it. I thought it was really sweet. I said, it's not a burden. It's not a burden. You, I, the but point now you're is, holding is it above do, my head. And now you're these, using it no, against I'm me. Not, and you're I'm saying not, like, oh my God, I've been I'm doing not, all this shit for you. I didn't ask for I'm it. Not, I'm not doing that. You are. I'm saying. You are. I'm saying. I, w I would not have done those things if they were a burden, and if you didn't make me happy. It's nothing to me. Um. Okay. Listen. Um. So, what do you want? I already told you what I want. What is it again? You. Okay. Like, what about me? Everything. I just want you. Okay. I'm not, I'm not that complicated. Okay, now ask me what I want. What do you want? Well, I told you, you know, I want to feel loved. I feel loved in maybe different ways than you might feel loved. I need money, you know, and, and gifts. I like that shit, you know? I'm pretty simple, too. I, I, I know. I know, you know, but you act like you don't know. Well, yeah, you haven't been around. Yeah, but you can still provide even if I'm not around. All right, point, point taken, point taken. You know my state ID. All right, you made your point. Thank you. Look, don't and make I me fight any more people apologize. at a fucking party, though. I won't. It's not. It's I not good for your optics. Apology. <laughs> I'm sorry if I upset you, April. I accept your apology. I only ever want to make you smile. And you're making me smile now. Smiles. Really? Yeah. We're good. So, yeah. Things are kind of crazy right now. You know that the person that tried to assassinate me was like released without being charged. Um, without being charged, how is that possible? I I don't know. It just happened last night. I just woke up to. It's pretty much. I still got to look into. Who that. was it? Uh, her name is Samantha Sanders. Samantha Sanders. Yeah. Tried to kill you for what reason? I don't know. You don't know? You have no idea? It was in the middle of a court case. I, I think she was mad about the outcome. Might have had political reasons. I don't know. Hmm. Okay. Well, can you stay safe for me, please? I will, I will always stay safe. And, uh, yeah. From, speaking of which, I do eventually need to call in the fact that I've shot this guy. Just to cover my own ass. Nah. Just blame it on Eli. I'm surprised no one. I'm surprised nobody ever came. It's kind of funny. Oh, uh, 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 <coughs> Lottie. Um, hey, uh, Murphy. Listen, I gotta meet. Uh, I gotta meet somebody at the park right now. Um, to to talk with them about some some memory stuff. So, um, but I just appreciate the talk, and you know, you know, going forward, what we can, um, you know, how things can change. I understand. Well, as always, it's very good to see you, especially. It's under always this, good uh, to see you. Yeah, the beautiful, lovely sun moonlight, sunset, sunset, yeah. moonlight. Yeah. Um. Okay. Well, it's yeah. All right. Well. 
Um, yeah, I mean, the bank is pretty close to here, so, you know, I'll probably make my way down there shortly. Got some, some banking to do. Some banking? Well, um... Yeah, it's a little, like, banking, you know. Okay. Well, I hope to it's be... in the neighborhood. Yeah. Well, you should stop there on the way. Um... I will. I will. Okay. <laughs> it's good to see you back in town. I good hope you to had see fun you too, Murphy. At your amazing concert that I've never been to in my life, because it's too far away. It's okay. Really Smoke Smello was really far, and I had to see my ex anyway. It was really awkward. Ooh, I hate seeing exes at concerts. It's terrible. Yeah. <laughs> Close your eyes. <gasps> then there. All right, well, Murphy. Um, I'll see you in a bit. Okay. Um, make a, right. make your stop at the bank, and um, yeah. Bye. All right. Tell Breckers to stop calling me though. Okay, Brekkers doesn't even know who I am anymore, so shouldn't be. Shouldn't uh, be I know. Problem. I told him to. I told him to give you money. I said you owe. I said he owed you money. Thank you. Yep. Bye, Murphy. You did so good. Do you think that went okay? I think it went so well. Okay, he. I, okay, it sounds. It sounds good. It sounds like he's. He's giving me money. Yeah, he got it though. Cool. You did. You you communicated. I, I thought the plot was lost there for a second. I know. You know he was did, getting did, real so, upset. I've never seen him get mad like that before. He had yeah, no, a backbone somewhere good. in that, and it freaked me out. I didn't know what to do. Yeah, but <gasps> no, no, you brought it back. You know, everything was good. You know, um, I I sneezed somewhere, and I don't know if you all could hear it. I'm sorry about that. I, I, yes. There was a there there was some like dandelion in here. I was honestly, just around it. Honestly, if you said the word and it wasn't gonna happen, honestly, I gave it like five seconds. If nothing happened or you didn't get money or some shit, I was just gonna knock him out and throw him in the ocean. Thanks, Hazel. Oh, yeah, that was the plan. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. No, you didn't say the word. You? I didn't say literally, the word. Yeah, you didn't say, I, didn't I, say I hamburger. I, I literally said, say the word and I got you. I'll knock him the fuck out. I didn't say it. I didn't say it. I was thinking about it at one point. It was going south. Uh, which part? Oh, um, which part I need to go to up? the main one where the bridge is. What's it called? Legion Square? Okay. 